The Army is updating combat support hospitals, or caches, into field hospitals to create a newer, more modular structure of battlefield care. The conversion reconfigures 248-bed caches into 32-bed field hospitals with the capability of three additional augmentation detachments, including a 24-bed surgical detachment, a 32-bed medical detachment, and a 60-bed intermediate care ward detachment. It's tailorable and scalable, and it's also responsive to different, uh, a different range of uh, military operations. The 10th cache was the first unit to convert into the field hospital design. What we need to be able to do is deploy worldwide uh, in support of any sort of global contingency operations um, in an in a expedient manner. Traditional caches have proven to be too large and logistically difficult to deploy as a whole, which is why the Army has historically only deployed slices or sections of the cache. The move to the field hospital design codifies that practice by restructuring caches in a way that they're primarily used as a customizable, scalable resource. In Army medicine, you know, we have to keep up with the changing environment. And so when we're on the battlefield, people want to know that the medical capability is there, something should happen. The U.S. Army Medical Materiel Agency, a subordinate organization of the U.S. Army Medical Research and Materiel Command, is leading the logistics of the conversion, including joint assessments with each unit and fieldings. We upgrade, we update, we give the soldiers and we give these units the most clinical items that are out there, or the most clinically viable items. We try to make sure that they have them on hand. So if there's ever a life or death issue, um, we make sure that they're prepared to handle that with the equipment and material that we give them. Over the next five years, the Army plans to convert the rest of the active duty caches as well as the Army Reserve Hospitals that are part of the Medical Material Readiness Program and Army Prepositioned Sustainment Stocks Hospitals.